guys, I'm Rachel Bonetta, and welcome to Off Topic. I recently made the trip down to Atlanta just in time for the unveiling of Atlanta United FC's name and logo. As you may know, Atlanta United isn't the only football team in that city. United owner Arthur Blank is also the owner of the NFL's Atlanta Falcons. So with the Falcons starting their preseason, I thought it would be fun to bring the two footballs together. Here's what we did. We teamed up with retired NFL quarterback DJ Shockley, who played with the Falcons for four years, and retired MLS and national team player turned technical director for Atlanta United, Mr. Carlos Bocanegra, to see how well these two former football stars could handle each other's sports. All right, guys, how are you feeling right now? Good. What do you mean I'm feeling? I'm feeling outstanding. <laughs> DJ, how do you think Carlos is going to do today? Just, just judging off our pre little workout we just had going on here, yeah. I think Carlos is going to be just fine. Oh, Played okay. some in high school, so he's not going to fool me. He's okay. not going to fool me that he's never going to play, so I know he's got it. I know he's got it in it. So. Okay, that was friendlier than I anticipated. What, what about you? How do you think DJ is going to do? I think he's going to do well. He's an athlete. You know, sometimes it's difficult when you don't use your feet a lot. It's a, different, it's a different skill. Okay, first drill, DJ's got to dribble through all of these. Hey, pay attention, focus. Okay, okay. DJ's got to dribble through all these and then shoot it into the net, and it's all about timing. Are you ready? It's all about accuracy, right? Accuracy and timing. All right. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go! Starting off strong. Oh, lost it a bit. <laughs> Well done. Three, two, one, go. Very quick. Oh, hit a pylon. Oh, oh, not Meg. <laughs> you got Meg. You got Meg. <laughs> All right, we're switching over to football. First drill, DJ, former NFL quarterback, is gonna throw some balls at uh, Carlos here, and I've gotta cover him. <laughs> Tell you what. No wonder those guys need a water break after every run. It's a difficult sport. Oxygen, water, cold towel. I need at least two plays off now. <laughs> oh, the triple pass! <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a pretty big tie between Carlos and DJ, so we're going to need a tie breaker, and it's going to be blind PKs. If you guys have never experienced blind PKs before, both of the shooters are blindfolded, as well as the goalie. Guess who's going in goal? Woohoo! Goal! It's already by you. Did it go in? Already by you. <laughs> what happened? Yeah, uh, winning the goal almost. Did it go in? Is that my ball over there? Yeah. <laughs> I hit up the toe, man. I don't know where I was at. <laughs> Ready? Bring it on! Oh! <laughs> All right. Three, two, one, go! Oh! oh. Right oh. side. It went, it went the other way. A lot harder than you thought. 
Okay, so uh, how do you think uh, Carlos did today? Uh, Carlos surprised me, you know. He didn't really teach me none of his tips. <laughs> he just wanted me to go out and just, no, he, he, was, he, was, he was awesome. I had a great time. Soccer is so much harder than I thought, though. Controlling that little ball with my feet is so much harder. Mm -hmm. But I think we're co-champions. Carlos is going to say he won, but I think we're going to be co-champions. That's, that's <laughs> what I'm saying, co-champions. What do you think? Uh, how did DJ do today? DJ did well, but I won. Yep. Just for the record. Yep. I told you he was going to say that. Uh, I told you he was going to say that. No, it was obviously a great sport. Um, soccer is quite challenging with the feet. Mm -hmm. uh, if you don't play from a younger age, it's tough to pick up. Thanks, guys. Thanks for hanging out. Thank you. I need a shower. I now understand why it's called a hot layer. It's hot, baby. It's hot, baby. It's hot. Bye. Football and football is a match made in Atlanta. We are so excited to have Atlanta United join Major League Soccer in 2017. The team has already sold nearly 24,000 season ticket deposits. Incredible support for MLS and the ATL already. Who do you guys think handled the other sport better? I pretty much bombed on both accounts, but we don't need to talk about that. <laughs> Thanks for watching Off Topic. See you later.